Welcome to this Windows Computer and Technology channel and uh, another little thing that is often overlooked and it drives a lot of people crazy and it particularly drives a lot of gamers crazy and that's the first thing that I did when I was actually um, gaming on my um, Asus uh, tough gaming PC. One of the things that I had noticed when I was playing games was a little temporary very quick freeze while I was playing games and I didn't realize at first what was going on but it seemed to happen roughly every minute and then um, on another machine that I was playing some other games um, that one was like yeah it does the same thing but like every half hour what what's the problem until I actually noticed exactly what happened and it had to do with the background wallpaper and how frequently it actually changes. So if you're using themes like I do, what's happening with these themes is that they have a cycle. So you can have them change every minute, every 10 minutes, every hour, every day. And that's where the problem lies is that when they change, that transition moment can actually make your games freeze just for a quick you know, microsecond, just enough to actually notice that the game froze, but then things come back to normal. And so what you want to do is change the timing. What's the cycle? So go to your settings app and right click on the start menu settings, go into personalization here, go into, so in the background, you'll see what you have and you know that you have pictures that might be shifting from time to time. Maybe it's a theme that you've been downloading from the Microsoft Store like I do. But the picture rate, change picture every. By default, when you download one, it's every minute. And that every minute is actually why my games every minute had a slight freeze, then it would continue on, and then the next minute would have. And the reason behind this your background changes even though you're gaming. Windows doesn't, you know, stop changing the background and doesn't stop doing it. It continues doing that in the background while you're doing something else. It could be anything else you're doing that maybe you see that there's a slight freeze. So change that to a longer time frame. I typically put one hour and I'm okay with that. But as a gamer, you might even want to change that into six hours or even just once a day. And so every day you have a new picture. But this definitely takes a toll on some machines. And especially if you're gaming or if you're doing some really high intensive CPU, um, you know, work, uh, Photoshop, or, you know, doing a lot of, of intense work that your PC has a lot of uh, different programs running at the, uh, at the same time and so on uh, in the multitasking, you might notice that there's that little freeze moment that happens. And of course, a lot of it could have to do with the uh, background picture that changes while you're working. So change that to a higher number. Um, anyways, I don't want to have it every minute. It does take some CPU cycles to have that picture change all the time. So, you know, an hour, I find that okay for me. Choose whatever is okay with you and make sure that um, you choose the proper time frame so that little, you know, stuttering of the Windows operating system doesn't happen. And that is a simple tip that will probably help a lot of people that wondered why their games or their workflow isn't as smooth as it was supposed to be. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.